Hmm. This main menu screen is awfully quiet for some reason. Well, anyway. We're playing Dark Souls once more. And this is where we were last time, right at the Valley of Drakes. And I said I would go ahead and figure my shit out from here, so. Well, for today, I think the plan is just going to be to mess around in New Londo ruins. Uh, I don't know how I did a jump attack there, but oh well. Well, anyway, I'm not going to bother with him. If he feels like it, he can throw himself off the cliff and I'll be happy, but if he doesn't, then so be it. I'm just going to ignore him. Mr. Big Dragon's still over here. But we're not going to be messing with him. We we haven't really messed with him, period, but uh, so far. But maybe later, once we're better geared up for this, but not right now. <coughs> Alright, so across the bridge we go, and then across the wooden plank we go to New Londo, and I think before I, uh, proper, uh, ee, before I head into New Londo proper, I'm going to... Can I jump across this? Oh, no problem. Before I head into New Londo proper, I'm gonna take a trip back to Firelink Shrine to grab the bonfire because it feels closer than this one that I... the other one I had before. So, Firelink. Take me... okay, yep, gotta pull this first. Not a lot of stuff in here, but oh well. <coughs> Not much that looks useful, at least. I guess the copper coin is there, but if I ever do want to farm something, maybe those guys in the dark root garden for the blooming moss clumps, for when I decide to go back into Blight Town, so I can rid myself of the toxic and the poison as well. But, you know. Oh, who are you? Stay there. Why, what a surprise. I didn't expect you to make it. Oh, <coughs> somebody ran the bell. Wait, was it you? You'll never give up, do you? I don't know how you do it. Well, don't stop now. Only one more. But it's going to be suicide. <laughs> well, thanks for the info. <clears throat> yeah, I can level up. I'm going to be going with strength because, of course, I want all the damage. I don't care about anything else. That is not how this goes. Okay, well... I don't know what I was doing there, but, well, there you go. We're just going to pretend that didn't happen. And we're just going to head on back and we're going to take the actual way, which is right here. There we go. It's a lot safer this way because you don't risk... You're not at m as much of a risk at falling off, which... You shouldn't be at risk of falling off, period. If you're smart and you're not dumb like I am, but oh well. Well, whatever. <clears throat> it's not important. I just drop down here. Yeah, no problem. A lot faster this way. What about the blacksmith guy over here? Does he have anything <clears throat> new to say to me? Magic's five-hander. Oh, he gives you magic stuff, I see. Mm. 
Does he have anything worthwhile to buy? Not really. <coughs> yeah, cough. Alright, well... Time to head back into the area proper, and we're gonna have to... Mess around with the curse and everything. Get the ghosts and stuff. Which I'm not sure I'm looking forward to, because there was a lot of ghosts last time, and they were kind of annoying. Not gonna lie. But oh well, we're gonna deal with it once we get there. At least the curse does seem to last for as long as you die, which is good. That way I don't have to worry too much about it. At least until I die, which... That was not a jump attack, but it worked out, so... It's okay with me. As long as they die, that's fine. That's all I want in life, because I can't dodge for shit, so... I'm just gonna have to hope they die before I do. And if a regular heavy attack can do that, then so be it. Leave me alone. We don't need you around here. That's one down. I wonder if I can kill them, if I can one-shot them with a regular attack. Oh, I sure enough can. Well, that's definitely is good to know. Ah, what? What are you doing through the floor? You can't just come up from under there like that. I did not mean to drink another SS there, I wanted to pull the lever. And it doesn't even work, so I just wasted the Nestus for absolutely nothing. Well, it do be like that sometimes, what can I say? Smash the pause because I'm still... I'm angry at that ghost, so now I need to take it out on something. Parrying dagger. Oh. Would you kindly leave me alone? And stop coming through the walls, I don't like it when you do that. Okay, so there's a fog over there, which means it could be the boss, so... Allow me to explore up here first. Yeah, well... Okay, I thought there was something over here, but turns out there's nothing at all, so never mind, we're just going to go into the fog wall, whether we like it or not. No. You just... No, you don't. I refuse. What? Okay. I don't know how that first jump attack missed, but... Well... It all worked out okay in the end, I think. Go through the fog. Staircase. Okay. And the ladder, hmm. Well, first off, I want what's here. You balls. Well, it's like a shortcut, okay. What? I have no idea how, how I'm missing out these jump attacks. Okay, so where does this lead me? Oh, I see. So I could like jump over here, okay. I hadn't realized that was a thing I could do before. Oh, I see, okay. Well, that's pretty cool. At least I have a shortcut if not a bonfire. No, don't shoot there. Should have figured that was gonna happen. Yeah, I really wish it was 
there was a more reliable way to know if you were going to just roll after you you jump like that. Because it feels like sometimes it just does and other times it doesn't, which honestly is a little no a little annoying if I'm being honest. But I guess I just have to get in the habit of using my plunge attack whenever whenever I want to avoid rolling off like that. Okay. I might as well use the curse right now. It's not going to leave me anyway, then what's the point of waiting until I get down there? <laughs> Alright, so back we go. Through the through the majority of all the hollows. Across the two bridges, well, they're not exactly bridges, they're more just like a bunch of wooden planks trunk together. <coughs> I'm gonna call them bridges if I want, so they're bridges now. No matter what you have to say about it, you can leave. So can you. 326, that's not bad actually. It's pretty good damage. That was terrible. That was supposed to be a, a dash attack, but... For some reason it didn't come out. Oh, thank you for the curse. That was not a jump. But it got me over there, so I won't complain. And as a matter of fact, that roll was probably a better idea than an actual jump, because... <coughs> but that's rolled. You're not going to roll after the roll, you know. Unless you deliberately press the roll button again. You balls. Oh. Thanks for the two more curse. I appreciate it. That's two more fails I have. Well. Okay, well, this doesn't really lead anywhere. But perhaps this does. Survey says no. There could have been an item there. Maybe just some random souls or something. No, would have been... Would have made the trek worth it at least. And there is nothing else either, so I guess we're just going to backtrack all the way to the ladder. It's not really far or anything, but... There's nothing else here, right? Well... To the ladder I go, if I can find it, right here. Okay, over there is just an item. It's probably some more ghosts waiting around in the rooftops trying to kill me. Eventually, right? No? That's weird. Well, whatever. Aw, oh, you balls. How about you stop this? Where did you use? Where did you even come from? Like for real. Leave, gosh. Stop coming through the walls like that. How did that guy not die? Would you kindly leave me alone, my goodness. You're just casually walking around and all of a sudden a ghost comes up from under the ground and starts slashing away at your ankles like... What a total, disres what total disrespect. Would you please? 
you can drink your Estus while you're on ladder in this game, okay. Well, that's good to know for future reference. And what are you? Oh, you're a friend. Alright, well, it's good to know that I can buy more curses from this guy if I ever need to. That ghost banner better not start hitting me while I'm going down the stairs. Oh, I hear you trying up there. Where did it go? Okay, well, apparently I've lost my curse. Let me just backtrack a little here. There you are. Now if you could just come over here. I'll be glad to slice you in half. Alright. So we're heading down the hallway. Keep in mind there was another path over there. That's a ghost. I don't think I don't see you. I do see you and I want you dead. That's an item. Oh, you're there, okay. Would you mind coming down just a little more, please? Thank you. And goodbye. May I never see your kind again. Wait. Oh. Oh, I see. Oh god, I'm getting mixed up now, okay. <laughs> At least I do know where I am now. Why do I get the feeling there's gonna be a ghost that's like coming, gonna come up from the water or something? Okay, well. That was. strangely free item. But you know what, I won't complain. This ghost is always fine by me because screw those things. That looks like an elevator that leads to a shortcut if I ever saw one. But of course it doesn't move. And yeah, of course it's locked. And this place is pretty darn big. And I haven't seen a bonfire in a while. It's starting to bother me. I just know eventually I'm going to die to some random bullshit and I'll be... I'll be sad and I'll have... I will realize I'll have to make my way back through like half an entire stage. Alright, so go up the stairs and then... This is yeah okay. This is the building where Ingward 
was. That's like the lower floor. Well, a lower part of the ceiling, I should say. And there's an item, which is what I want. Rare Ring of Sacrifice, what does that do? What's the difference between a rare one and a regular one? I might as well have a look. Die, lose nothing, nullify curse, ring breaks. Oh, okay. That's not where I need to go. I need to go down these stairs right here. It was over here. Did I ever go? No, I did not go this far yet. Curse by train. No. I don't care what you think you're doing. I don't want any of it. <coughs> okay, so heading back up the stairs again. Because, you know, once is fun, but twice is better. That's not a saying at all. It's nothing, period. It's just something I just said, like, for no reason. Well, anyway. Uh, thanks for the humanity. But where does that leave me? <laughs> it's not exactly the way forward. So I'm guessing I must have missed something around here then. Probably something that lets me either move this elevator up. And or open the door that was there. It's probably something very obvious that I just managed to miss somehow. Oh, that's the value of Drix over there. Well, it makes sense because they do link up together, so... It does kind of make sense you could see one from the other. That also means that's probably where this elevator leads, to the Valley of Drakes, I mean. Well, there's nothing here. And this door doesn't open. Well, that's probably where I'm supposed to go, it probably just opens from the other side, and that's the thing you need to... Like, have to turn the wheel over there. To get the... the elevator to come up. And that's... you probably just... Open the door from there. The real question is, how do I get over there? Right. If I had to guess, it's probably somewhere in this building that I need to be checking. I probably just haven't found it yet for some reason. Because it's kind of convoluted as hell. <coughs> yeah, this is where you come from. And then there's this that leads you to the elevator. The ladder, okay, well. And then there's this, which leads you god knows where. Well, at least it's that item. It loops back around. Yeah, right here, okay, well. Yish. <laughs> I am officially confused. <laughs> because now I don't really know where I'm supposed to be going. Okay, well, take the ladder, maybe. The vantage points will help. We'll see. Because there's no more ghosts in the staircase, so there's that. That's where I just was. Of the dark 
dark rates are the enemies of man, they were bought for that is how created. Hmm. Okay, well, that's cool and all, but <clears throat> where does that leave me? Yes, well, I guess I'm just gonna go through the stage backwards and see if I can find anything. Otherwise, I guess I'll just have to make my way to Blight Town instead. God help me. <laughs> yeah, okay, well. Can't see shit around here, my goodness. Why does it have to be so dark? Yes, I know you exist. Now come down so I can kill you. Oh god. That was almost really bad. Ah, oh, balls. My curse is gone. Well. We're just gonna say screw it and that guy can live for all it's worth. Oh, but there's more ghosts around here, so I should probably actually use another one. You, I totally forgot you were a thing. I somehow made it through all of that without getting hit. And all of those guys can die. Triple kill, not bad. No. I said no. Alright, well... This room felt suspiciously like an elevator, but it's not an elevator. And then there's this place, where there used to be a lot of ghosts, but I guess just all came down to see me instead. And that's another elevator that doesn't move. I.e. it doesn't help me whatsoever. Okay, so... I guess... Maybe down in the ruins somewhere. I'm gonna have to make sure I don't accidentally yeet myself off into the water and die. Yeah, it definitely doesn't look like there's m anything more here. Well, I am officially lost in this place, so I guess for now I'll just uh, screw it. And head somewhere else instead. Opens dungeons of undead asylum in the north. Oh. It's too bad I can go back there. Opens door leading to lower undead bird. That's probably somewhere I could go. If I just find it out figure out where it is. 
Otherwise, I suppose I can always go back to the graveyard with the skeletons and reach the catacombs. I believe is what's after this. After the skeletons, I mean. I'm probably missing something very obvious, and I'm just really dumb, and I'm gonna hate myself once I figure it out. Well, it is what it is. But for now, we're gonna take a quick trip to Firelink Shrine. At least I've got plenty of curses for whenever I end up coming back here. Yeah, alright. Firelink Shrine, my favorite. Hello you, both of you. But I don't care about either of you. Mr. Frank. Well, I still have my tennis at least, so that's cool. Yeah. This is the way to the undead burg. What if I take a quick trip around here? Maybe see the skeletons once more. There's someone sleeping around here. Well, I guess I'll just have to figure out where the hell they are. I'm gonna find you. I don't care where you are. He's probably up top, actually. So... It's an awfully weird ledge. I'll just be poking out right there. Mr. Giant Crow. Okay, I'm not seeing the guy wherever he happens to be. That was that fall damage. That was like a two inch drop. Oh, hello. I will teach you He doesn't have anything worthwhile. Come again. All these spots are awfully suspicious. But they're not hiding anyone, so oof. Right, well, whatever, I guess. Whoever's sleeping out around here can just have a nice rest. I will be ignoring them for now and I will go ahead and get myself murdered by skeletons instead. Sounds like a more enjoyable alternative if you ask me. Easy one shots. Scimitar, well. It's cool and all, but I don't think I'll be using it. Balls. Another scimitar, okay. Large soul of a lost and dead. Slip down there. Disturb the graves, because why not? No oh, balls. Okay, I can one-shot them with a regular attack. That was... I have no idea how I made it out there without taking any damage. 
And we're just gonna roll with it because we're gonna pretend I deserve it. Even though we all know that I don't. That's good. Okay, I legitimately thought I fell off a cliff and died there. Good to know that's not the case. And it's good to know there's a way back to the path. Also, please leave me alone. That's where this Vihander was. So I don't need to go over there. I kicked your shield out. All out the way, that was pretty mean actually. There's probably something more up there, but that's a lot of skins. Skelly men's. No. Oh god, I've woken them all up. Oh god. <laughs> well, that kind of worked out. I suppose I, I suppose I'll let it slide. We're gonna say it's good enough. Kind of wish it didn't take away like almost half of my health, but no, thanks for the binoculars, dude. Well, it's whatever. I guess I should have been more careful there. But... You know, I didn't feel like it. Jump attacks are cool. And I wanted to end it with a jump attack. Gross. Burp. Hope you enjoyed that one. Alright, so down into the catacombs, I think is what it is. Into the bone zone. Carthus, thank you. Oh, what? Oh, that's what that is. I see now. I saw you, you and your white eyes, you're gonna come back to life, aren't you? Yep. Ah. Uh. Oh, alright. Well, how about no? Kindly. Gosh, those things. There sure are a lot of students around here. So they don't want to stop respawning. Which is pretty freaking annoying, I gotta admit. Bonfire. I don't care who you are, but you can be you. Please, just light the bonfire. Thank god. That was an absolute fucking mess, what the hell. Why would you... Please. Friggin' hell. I don't understand what's going on anymore. Whatever this skeleton business is, I, I have no idea how it works anymore. And I don't know how much I want to be a part of it. Maybe it's because I'm not killing them in a single hit anymore is why I thought they kept respawning. Okay, so now they're dead, right? 
Right, so did we backtrack up? See if there was anything I might have missed. Okay, well I can kill them in a single hit with a heavy attack. But watch your soul counter to make sure that they are indeed dead. That's the beginning. That is not an invisible wall, okay. Well, alright. It's a good thing I managed to accidentally stumble into that bonfire by taking the right way. By pure freaking happenstance. Ooh. This looks good. At least this place looks nice, but... All I see are Sanic's captains rolling at me and some dude over there throwing fireballs at me. You didn't give me any souls, you're gonna come back to life, I know it. Come on. No. Thank you. You still didn't give me any souls, what the hell, dude? I politely ask that you die for good this time. If you come back to life once more, I will smite you into hell. You and your freaking shield. Which you kindly. You still didn't give me any soul. What the hell is this, dude? How many times do you intend to actually respawn? Dude, that skeleton is gonna drive me nuts. Kindly stay down. I swear to god, he's not gonna stay down. You know what? Screw this. You're not gonna stay down either, I just know it. Well, I guess I'll just gonna. I'll just, I'm just gonna have to ignore skeletons from now on. Pretend they don't exist. God. What the hell? Okay, seriously. Well... This isn't gonna work. And those guys, they die for good. For some reason, the other ones don't, which... I don't know what the hell is up with them, but... Okay, now you die for good. Okay, well, I officially have no idea how skeletons work in this game. <laughs> like, sometimes they want to die, but sometimes they don't. No, oh, that's where you are. Well, I gotta admit that skeletons kind of suck in this game. <laughs> They're fast as hell. They can decide whether whether they want to stay down or not. They hit pretty freaking hard too. I missed. Well, 
That backstab's gonna have to do. That was supposed to be a side roll, but well, as long as it works. Well, whatever. Large soldier, the name is Soldier, alright. God, none of these. This place crawling with skeletons is also a freaking labyrinth. It's at this point that I realize I have no idea what I was getting myself into once so I decided I was gonna come here. Thank you. At least so. Not bad. But not good because I'm not going to be using it either. Okay, well, there was nothing else here. So. Is that an invisible wall? No, it's not. It's literally just a dead end. This is a drop down here. Good. Well, well done, me. You just wasted 30 seconds of your life. Well, I mean, admittedly, wasting time is the only, it's pretty much the only thing I do with my life, so. Oh, Ah, okay. oh, what? Okay, this was. Okay, at least those things kill themselves when they come after you, so. I didn't realize they killed themselves, but... Okay then. Ah, oh, god. Thank you. Well, I just say this place could certainly be more enjoyable. Please leave. You think I can hit this guy? Well, maybe I could have if he hadn't moved backwards. But it doesn't matter. Yeah, right. Gosh. You can parry that? Oh my god, okay. Well, since you failed to get the crit, I'm gonna show you how it's done. Yeah, that sh sit your ass down. I don't need you in my life. I don't need you, period. Haha, hit through the wall. Take that, you bitch. God, I am being very vulgar with these chattens around here. Well, I won't try to justify it, they just suck and I don't like them. So, yeah. They make me angry, is basically what I'm trying to say. I'm so surprised you can actually like bury an heavy attack from a from a colossal sword. That's pretty impressive. Because usually these kinds of things are 
unparryable for a reason, but not in this game apparently. He just got all in his parry stance and I thought, okay well Joke's on you, here's an attack you can't parry, and then I got parried. I guess I was too far enough away for him to just get the crit, which to actually get something out of it, which is fine with me. That is a big explosion, good sir. Also that statue, you cannot like destroy it. No, I'm just gonna have to roll through it. Thank you. Goodbye, skeleton, sir. And there's a guy shooting fireballs over there. He's guarded by two skeletons. Can you parry a jump attack, though? Yeah, I didn't think so. You can parry a heavy attack, but not a jump attack, apparently. What? That attack is so dumb. And as for you, I don't know what you're doing here, but... Oh god. Oh, don't you dare knock me off. Please just knock him off. Why do you die in a single hit? <laughs> you know what? That works. Yep. That's how I'm going to be dealing with skeletons from now on. I'm going to push him off a cliff. If I can, that is. I have to admit, I seriously don't understand how these cannons work. It's like if you kill them and then you die. Well, when you come back, you actually do get to kill them for real, but... If you haven't killed them once already, it doesn't work for some reason. It's just weird, like, I don't... I honestly don't get it. I got a thousand souls there. For what? But if I know, that's Patches over there. It's sort of a proud knight. Yeah, and now he decides not to respawn. I seriously don't get it. I need someone to explain it to me. Because goodness they suck well if you want it to be like this I will not complain I mean I sure as hell don't mind if you just yeet yourself off the cliff like that that's less work for me oh I see how it is Hmm. I did not expect to be falling into a trap floor around here. Right? When I think about it, I should have expected it. Well, I kind of caught that one too soon. Too late, I mean. Nah, you balls. A ladder, yeah, it is. It doesn't look like a ladder, but it works as one, which is all I need. Get me out of here and then take this hole instead. That looks like a way to progression, actually. Or does it? Is it actually a way to progression? No, this is back to where I just was like two seconds ago.
Ugh, all right. So that's what happens if I go down the left. What if I go right instead? Nothing. Oh, I see. Ugh, all right. Oh, well. That was a funny little adventure. still alive. Don't worry, I can tell. Well, I guess this is just how I'm gonna go about it. I'm gonna move forward like two inches and I'm gonna have to go back and mess around with some skeletons every five seconds. Stupid. <laughs> Stop blo body blocking me, just get out of the way. <laughs> That's a ways back. <laughs> you will use those. Which I will use to kindle my bonfire so I can get more of this. I will use those for some free levels before I keep going. <coughs> that should be enough for like two levels at least. I kindled one hollow, yeah, I need to do this first. Now you can do. Thank you. Now I can level up some more strength, which isn't really going to help me around here, but it's whatever. Now it's time for part something of Skeleton, of the Skeleton Rampage. Oh god. What a fun area. With enemies that respawn that don't want to die for some reason. You're not the one I wanted to lock onto. Ugh. 
Ugh, my goodness. I'm already getting sick of this place. Oof. Equip some homeward bones just in case I ever need to leave in a hurry. Oh god. I heard that roll attack so much. Yeah, that's what you deserve. <clears throat> Nothing more. Thanks for the free kill, buddy. I appreciate you coming to end yourself with the skeleton there. That's where we did anything but besides that small attack, and I would have. That would have been fine right there. So now the real question is do you die now? Yeah, now he dies. <clears throat> now those guys die as well, for some reason. Well, I won't complain really, I'm just glad that they're finally leaving me alone. Peace out, you. Non, c'est pas un big W, ça sucks. Je me suis fait trouver chaud par les skiers. I just saw a skeleton fall down there. That was a switch I pushed. Well, I did fall there, and I landed on something not too far below, but... I did see another path up here, so... We're gonna take some time to check it out. See where it leads. To a staircase that gets you straight to hell. Moving along to the side path instead. Thank you. Much appreciated. Aha! Saw that one. That's pretty obvious, given the color and everything. Thank you, my goodness. Ah, oh, god, that was an exercise in frustration. 30 strength. What more do you need? Probably some more health and endurance. This is probably what I'm going to be taking after this. And that's not a roll, gosh darn. Wait, there was a ladder there. Let me see where that ladder leads. Oh, there you are. You sure about that?
Yeah, I realized that. Okay. Oh, well, no fall damage, so who cares? So I guess I, before I head to the boss, I'm gonna go ahead and see where that drop takes you. I heard someone die. Good. Where did you come from? Yeah, that's what I thought. Sit your ass down. That's not a jump you're making. Not like that, at least. That's not too big a fall, actually. Neither is that. A green titanite shard. The question is, is there anything below me at this point? Well, we won't find out by staying here. Yeah, there is. There's also a cutscene. My bad. I didn't realize you were mining away out here. Wait, what happened to my Estus? Why didn't... Give me my Estus back, please. I guess I'd have to kindle that bonfire. I'm still not 100% sure how this whole Kindle thing works, but whatever. I guess 7 Estus would have been okay, but... Fires by hand, though. Purchase stuff. Ooh. Could buy some tight night shards, I suspect, I suppose. Not that I really know what I'd use them for. But... I guess I could have grid a battle axe for shits and giggles. leave you to it. Oh boy. That did not look like it hit. But, well, I will not complain. What? Oh god, there's a lot of those guys around here. There sure are a lot of those guys around here. Goodness me, why is there so many of you? Okay, well, you know what? Take the hits and just smack them out of it. Why is there so much? How many of them are there? Good. Jesus. Okay, that was just stupid. 
I couldn't even get I didn't even get to roll out of the way there, I just got cornered. Well there goes all my humanity. That was almost on my health. What the hell, dude? Okay, well, those things officially suck. At least they don't come back to life, so I guess that's the only good thing about them. No. Stop your rolling shenanigans. Leave me. Let me live my life in peace, thank you. Jesus Christ. Oof, well, now that I'm done with the Great Wheel Massacre. At least I think I'm done with the Great Wheel Massacre, and there's probably some more around here, and I just can't see them. Show yourself, I know you're here. Okay, well, apparently that's all that was. A black knight with an axe. For some reason I get a feeling I should have used my Estus, but whoop. Well, as long as he's dead, it's good enough for me. Nope. I don't want to deal with this in such a tight corridor. Maybe I can like You know what, I'm gonna invite them to this big room where there's some actual space. And we'll just have to wait and see if they follow. Well, they sure enough are coming. Well, that guy with the lantern at least is coming. Oh, you managed to survive a jump attack. I'm impressed. That's a ladder. I don't know why I did so much more damage to that guy compared to the other, but... No, oh, there it is. No way forward. Well, it's not exactly the way forward more than anything, it's just... Back down here. These coffins are all awfully suspicious. I want to see if there's something more over there. It does feel like there sh definitely could be. <laughs> Stupid nose.
Yeah, it's definitely something. Another trap floor. That leads to the exact same place. Well, I guess we're gonna call it good enough for now. Nice jump. Totally intentional, I swear. Alright, so to the actual way forward, I hope. Because if this doesn't lead me to the way forward, then... How do I get out of here? Maybe that's a fog. But it's not a boss fight, apparently. Or maybe it is. Nope, that's not how this works. Hey, it's Pinwheel. The other is just boss in the game. Which means I'm gonna have to die to him at least once. Okay, well... Never mind, I guess I will not be dying to him at least once. <laughs> well, okay. That sure was a boss. Mask of the Father. <laughs> well, I don't even know what I say to that. That was just laughably easy. <laughs> this mask do I wonder slightly raises equipment load oh, that could be good it only looks slightly ridiculous all right so I guess I just need to use a more bone to get out of here then Really twin, yes, this that should come in handy somewhere. All right, so now I just need to find out how I get back. You know, this place is cool and all, but it's not really helping me. And now I'm back to Bone Wheel Hill. If I keep messing around hard enough, eventually I'll find a way back out of here. I hope so, at least. 
Kinda suck to just get stuck. Oh, there's a ladder here. Huh. I don't know why, but for some reason, ladders are the one things I always miss in these games. If there's a ladder somewhere, there's like a 95% chance I won't see it on my first, my first time going through for some reason. <coughs> okay. I can't help but feel like something is gonna come at me sooner or later and I won't be prepared for it and I'll just die. Well, apparently it doesn't seem to be the case right now. Leave me alone, this statue. Yikes, that was a close one. Okay, well this is not a part of the stage I've already have been to before. I thought it might have been a shortcut to one of the previous places. One of the previous parts of the stage, like the beginning or something. This coffin is awfully suspicious, solid all over here. <laughs> Nestle and coffin. It's another one of you. Just like last time, you do have a lot of health, don't you? Yeah, well, that wasn't as much damage as I thought, honestly. Sorry, your jump attack missed there, buddy. Oh, wow. Yeah, just leave already. Titanite catch pole. That's probably his weapon, I suppose. Eye of death, what the hell. Lure phantoms from other worlds, oh, okay. Yeah, right here. Oh, right, that's magic damage. Not bad. But I don't have the dexterity for it. And I don't really plan on having the dexterity for it. Nestled in coffin, sure. Alright, fine. I thought I'd trigger a cutscene or something. It turns out it's just a quick sleep with a nap that you need to take in the afternoon. Yeah, well, it's enough about that. Time to progress. Time to progress for real this time. It's 
attempt to get impaled by some more statues and face the wrath of more infinitely respawning skeletons. Jeez. Yeah, that's... <laughs> you balls. You absolute balls. I hope you know just how much of a balls you are. That made no sense. But well, that kind of had the expected, uh, that kind of got me the expected outcome. Okay, I promise to you I wasn't holding right as much as it looked. Like... I genuinely tried to roll forward there, but for some reason I just went right instead. I gotta admit, I really don't understand how rolls work in this game. It just feels like they never go the way you expect them to for some reason. I'm gonna get no. Yep. Well, the skeleton is dead, and I I like to prefer that over everything else. You know, I can get hit as long as the skeleton is gone. That's good enough for me. You still didn't give me any souls. What's wrong with you? And I don't know what that skeleton over there was doing. But... Dude, that's... Sit down, please. There. So if he respawns, he should respawn down there, right? No. You're too cool for that? Well, yeah, that's what I thought. Off with you. That's a valid way of, skele of killing skeletons if I've ever seen it. Well, I'm not going to go over there just yet. Oh, that's actually... Oh. Now I'm going through the stage backwards. Alright, well, I guess I will follow with this presumably Patch's advice and... Head down instead.
You know what, that's good enough. I managed to get the stairs. The ladder, I mean. I don't need anything else. Okay, well I might preferably need a way out of here as well. That's not how this goes. Well, you know what? That counts for something, right? A free 800 souls. Was, wasn't exactly free, but... There's another ladder there. You're starting to bother me, so I'm gonna kill you just for fun. Okay, so. Where did you come from? Now, so how did that not hit you? <laughs> Stupid. Okay, well... Once again, I think I've officially lost myself now. That's not where I was supposed to go. <laughs> oh, freaking hell. And now I'm all the way back here. Oh, freak me. Oh, I swear. There goes that. Nothing to do but give it another try. enough of you. That just leads you to pinwheel, so what am I doing over here? Well, maybe there's something I missed. Hold on. No, I definitely did not miss anything. Okay, well. I mean, I could always, like, climb out of the catacombs, but what good would that do me right now? Well, I have killed the boss around here, so I suppose that's technically the area is done, I guess. So I guess I might as well just climb out as well at this point. Go back to Firelink Shrine and think about what my next objective is. Probably try to go back to Undead Burg and find my way to the lower Undead Burg. Because that is a key I have not gone, I have not used yet, I think.
we're just gonna think about it, give it a, a big long think while we're making our way back there. I'll have plenty of time with all the freaking skeletons in the way and everything. I suppose I could always try to drop down there and figure out how this works. Will this drop kill me? Well, let's find out. Nope. Okay. Not bad. I saw sort the of name of soldier. I'll take that. Then there's this right here. Alright. That was not really worth it, but... Goodbye wheel, my goodness. Well, at least now I know what those items are and they won't be bothering me for the rest of my days. But it also means that I'm gonna have to climb those ladders again. Alright. So I get a bit annoying doing this trek over and over again. Well, I guess that's just part of the experience. Those godforsaken skeletons are also part of the experience, as much as I wish they weren't. What? <laughs> okay, can you die now for real? No, you still don't die. Okay, well I'm just going to ignore you then. I wonder if I can make that jump. Oh, wait. You know, that's not a jump I want to be making, admittedly, but... You can piece off. Oh, frick me. <laughs> oh, gosh dang it. I shouldn't have gone for that. Well, at least I have an idea of where, of how I make it across. And by an idea, I mean I'm pretty sure I know how I make it across. There. Eventually I'll make it out of this this godforsaken hellhole, and I will be so relieved to make it to be out of here. I have spent way too much time. My goodness. Some more exploding skulls. That's Jatan threw himself off the cliff. I will thank him for that. As Jatan is rolling. And I do not like it when Jatans are rolling at me.
That's not invisible at all. That statue doesn't fail you. Keep that in mind. Where did you come from? I'm gonna try to knock him off the cliff again because I don't want him coming back to bite me in the ass later. Except I went too fast, so I'm just going to just screw it instead. I've only got so much patience to allocate to these god forsaken skeletons. I'm not taking my souls back then. Yeah, this is where I tried to jump. What the hell, dude? Please leave. So right here, I know where that spot down there is, but I don't really care. Yeah, great sight. Yeah, so this one is the one that crumbles. It just takes you back here, okay. Well, you know what, that's not too bad, actually. Alright, now it's time to get out of here, for real this time, before I lose my mind. Don't you dare. Phew, okay. What an absolute mess of a stage. I don't even remember where this takes you, but... Ah, a bonfire. Well, you know what? I won't complain. I sure as hell couldn't possibly complain at this point. Any bonfire that takes me, gets me closer to the exit is well worth it. Now I just have to run through the rest of the stage. And hopefully it won't take too long. go here? Yeah, it's just this bottomless pit. Well, it's not this bottomless pit, it's this trap floor is what I meant to say. Might there be anything of particular note over here? I don't remember. There's some more impaling statues. What is that? You change your mind? Like, why'd you just run back for no reason right there? That was kind of funny, admittedly. There. Yeah, this is the place where you can see patches. You can also see that bonfire right there. That's pretty cool, actually. Well, it's time to stop messing around and it's time to actually get out of this place. Ow. Yeah, that's where I came from. 
you leave me alone I said leave me alone uh, okay thanks for going down there you can leave me alone as well good enough I have no idea what that skeleton was doing there but well free souls and less captains to worry about that did not hit but you know what I want I won't complain I will just take it and that's gonna that's all the that's all that's gonna be I'll just take it and nothing more so bonfire time second bonfire time thank you for not bothering me do I have any humanity left only one ish it's not exactly good but oh well Thanks for the shield. Alright, there's the ladder. Almost out of this godforsaken place. Uh, I can't even, like... Describe how happy I am to finally be out of here. Try and parry this. Okay, fine. I guess I'll just have to accept that explosion is bigger than I think it is. Alright, so we're leaving the catacombs. Hopefully for good, because if I'm have if I ever have to come back here, I'm going to lose my mind. So, the skeletons around here aren't as strong as the ones down there. They don't even give them any souls. The big ones only gave 500, but he gave 800 down in the catacombs. So. It's kind of funny. How did that bone get over there? Oh god. I would have been so angry if that roll had <laughs> got me off the cliff and killed me. Alright. Glad to be back here. Honestly, I'm just glad to be anywhere other than this godforsaken pit. I couldn't really care where I am at this point as long as I'm not in the catacombs anymore because holy shit. Uh, I'm sorry for all the profanity, but damn, that area was not fun. I still don't know what's going on with Mr. Crow over there. <laughs> Ugh, alright. Take the bonfire. And while I'm here use all of those souls to get myself a couple of level ups probably well I don't really know how many level ups I'm going to be getting from this actually <laughs> probably like two at best even then I think I need like 9,000 for a level up yeah so not even two well
<sighs> Alright, Undead Berg. Please take me in your sweet embrace once again. Well done, dude. That was some good damage. Don't you dare step on me. Did I get any other ring besides this? Grants additional attunement slots, well... No, I might as well keep it, just in case I find myself at low health eventually. Me and my whole motto of kill things before they kill you. Stupid rats. Alright, so I guess I'm looking for a locked door in Undead Bird, right? It's not this one, I can tell you that. I'll try and find my way to the lower Undead Bird. Where's that guy throwing fire bombs at me? Well, it doesn't matter, I'll find him and kill him soon enough. Or he'll just get to live because he won't really be in the way of where I'm going. completely pointless that jump attack yeah easy triple kill yeah that was a bit of a wonky jump but whatever We're just going to be taking a pleasant little walk through Undead Burg until I find the door that leads me to lower Undead Burg. It's got to be more relaxing than those catacombs at any rate. And I will take anything after this area. Ooh. But that jump. <laughs> How did I fail that jump? Well, maybe I'm supposed to come from up here. Probably. I imagine so. I don't even bother trying to dodge anymore, I'm just trying to kill things. Oof. Sorry to step on your corpse there, buddy. Roll, whatever. Stop. Wait, what was over here? No, right here. Oh, still keeping your marbles all together. Go ahead, don't be a nitwit. 
Never hurts to splurge when your days are numbered. <laughs> Except he doesn't really have anything. Oh, that could be a good idea. So could that. Here I thought he didn't actually have anything worthwhile. Club. He does have an A in strength. It could potentially be a good idea, but thank you kindly. <laughs> I won't be bothering with it. All I need is a giant ass sword. Because giant ass swords are cool, what can I say? Well at least I managed to get myself another key, which that was weird. Which should help me in in finding some prog some progression there, jeez. This takes you back down. This just takes you to the balcony where there's like an item, and that's about it. This is back to the beginning, but well really this whole house leads back to the beginning whether you like it or not, so. Okay, now that I've got the key to the undead Berg's residences, I suspect I might be able to actually find a way, a way forward soon enough, hopefully. Yeah. Burp. No, it's well. I just ran straight into that area. Thanks for your worst cloth, even though I have like six of them at this point. I don't really need any more, believe it or not. But you know, I'll take it. Maybe one day I'll find a way to sell them and then I'll be happy with having six of them. I'll be able to sell like all six of them for 30 souls each or something. Oh glorious day. <laughs> and that's a chest. I've already gotten. That's a door, probably one that I couldn't open before. Because it probably required the residence key, I assume. Well, I guess we'll find out soon enough. After I come ahead and kill these guys, because, well, they're annoying. Oh god. Fine, I'll climb the ladder a second time then. Hmm. Alright, well. Unlock for me, Odor. If you don't, I'm gonna be very sad. I do hope this leads somewhere though, because if it's just a dead end or a chest at the end, I'm gonna be disappointed. Well, consider me disappointed. Gold Pine Resin, that's pretty good though. Oh wait, that's, that's probably the way to the lower undead bird, but let me kill those guys first. I don't really have any reason, I just feel like it. There. My bloodthirst has been quenched, so I can move forward now. Also, I should stop soon. 
Uh, well, you know what? Let's just keep going until we find the bonfire and we'll stop there. How about that? Yeah, this is straight to hell. But... I didn't even realize it was already 6 p.m. But oh well. That's just an item. Ugh. Cringe. Well, we're just gonna keep going then. Eventually we'll find a locked door that leads you to Lower Undeadburg and then everything will be fine. It's not over there, at least I can tell you that. I wonder if you can like jump in that hole from the slip right there. Honestly, I don't feel like trying it. I don't want to lose my souls again. Like, I just don't really see a reason to go ahead and do it. This was where Avel was. And this leads you to Darkroot Garden, if I remember. Oh, it leads you to Darkroot Basin, actually. I think. Well, I guess we'll see once we get there. Yeah, that leads you to that place in Darkroot Basin. I guess I could try to kill that serpent now. I might have enough damage. But not today. Maybe with more Aristus and stuff, but... For now, we're just going to forget about it. I don't really think it would give me much of anything anyways. Maybe like a bunch of souls, but... What else would it give me, you know? Probably not progression, so... All these barrels. So this is a little bit. This takes you to Taurus Demon. The staircase goes nowhere. What if I, like, took the ladder here? I know there's those two guys at the top, but... Thanks for the crossbow, I guess. Not that I'll be using it anytime soon, I'm psh, I believe. But oh well. Yeah, alright. This doesn't lead you anywhere. Would have been a fun little way to hide a secret, I guess. But just a secret, not a path to progression. Yeah, that's probably the door, yeah. That's the door I was looking for, so there's still here. Nope, he's gone, okay. Alright, now that I... Well, is the dragon still there? If he isn't, I'm just gonna get those guys, take the bonfire, and... We'll call it there. He, sure enough, still is here. So, you know what? Screw this. <laughs> Forget about it. I did not mean to drink my essence there. There should be a bonfire close enough here. This is the beginning of a new area and all. Thank you. At least I hope there's a bonfire close by. Because I really should be calling it quits soon. Those are dogs. Oh my god, they're fast. How did you not get hit? Well, whatever. Oh, that's a shortcut to a dead bird, okay. Well, I'm glad I checked that first then. Take the dogs down the stairs. They don't get to stay upstairs. They weren't supposed to be there in the first place. Can I smash this? Services, no. 
more dogs well that I thought I'd have a bit more time before I get hit from that, no, I guess not. It's not like it mattered. Anybody help me. Unlock the door. Damn. I'm finished. How did this ever happen? There. Are you happy now? Brilliant. You opened the door for me. Thank you. I'm saved. I thought I might never escape. I am Griggs of Vinheim. The sorcerer of the school. I am much obliged for your assistance. Thanks to you, I may now resume my travels. Oh, hello. I'm fine. I will rest a while, then return to Firelink Shrine. I have my sorcery. And I will be more cautious next time. Besides, I have an important task at hand. Alright, well. I wish you luck with whatever that is. No, I don't want to talk to you. I want to take this. Oh, whole bunch of wizardry that I will not be making any use of. No, yeah. oh, whoa, 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 whoa! I didn't realize you were there as well. That was supposed to be a jump attack, but oh well, that's a jump attack, and I whiffed. Fantastic. That's a jump attack. 412, not too bad. I do say so myself. Yeah, feel free to hit me all you want, see if I can. It's only a matter of time until I rekindle a bonfire and get my Estus back, anyways. Yeah, can't open that door. That door is key proof, I suppose. Can I open this one though? Uh, nope, but apparently there is something on the other side. And whatever it was, it is gone now. What? Oh, I see. Some bandits and stuff. How dare you get it hidden? Mail breaker, cool, cool. This poor guy that got hit through the door never saw it coming. Imagine you're just chilling behind a door and suddenly some sword just cleaves through reality and slices you clean in half. That's kind of scary to think about, actually. This museum really makes you work for your bonfires, does it? Dog, no. Well, you got a head in at least. What? I see how it is. Did he just... Side step out of the way. Large soul of a lost in there. Okay, I know what boss is at the end over there. That's another dog. Is there a bonfire down here, first and foremost? Well, I think that's a boss over there. If it is a boss, then I know which one it is. <laughs> I knew there was a guy there, but I was kind of hoping you... I could do things my way. Leave me alone. That is not a bonfire. It's a big ass tower with some guy shooting arrows at me. I appreciate you tried your best, sir, but you were not good. You might need to reconsider your hobbies. 
Buy a couple of those. I wish I could buy humanity, but apparently I don't have what it takes. Take some of those as well. This is a wonderful place, don't you think? We have water, nice moisture, these nice iron bars. I like it here, I really do. Nothing good ever happened to me in life, but now that I'm undead, I've never been happier. That's weird, dude. Well, I definitely will come again if I manage to remember that you exist and I manage to remember where you exist. Okay, you know what? I should probably take this opportunity to head back to Fighting Shrine. Just take the bonfire there because it's starting to get late right now. I should stop the stream soon. I figured I would keep going until I find a bonfire or until I died, but this is the closest bonfire I'm gonna get, so we're gonna go and we're gonna get it. Oops. Six eighteen. <laughs> Not bad at all. Uh, Fighting Shrine, I've missed you. <laughs> hey, it's you again. Oh, hello. I regret meeting you under such compromising circumstances. At least we both made it back unscathed. Oh, hello. Terrific to see us both in one piece. And pray that you never go hollow. Yeah, so this is the guy where that you need 10 into 10 int in order to be able to do anything with him. Access bottomless box. Well, you know, maybe I should, like, use my... I said I was going to use my souls, but I don't really have any souls, so... We're just going to say screw it instead. Alright, well, that was the stream. Oh, jeez. Finally managed to make some progress. Managed to kill Pinwheel, which was a boss, quote-unquote. And also, that was just... Well, I spent a lot more time than I would have liked in the catacombs, but that's okay. These kinds of stuff happens. Well, there we go. That was it. I hope you had fun watching the stream with me today. At least I had fun, I know that. So, thank you guys for watching. If everything goes right, I should be able to s see you guys tomorrow once more and also on Friday because, well, it's my week off of work, so I'm taking the opportunity to stream to the Thursday and Friday as well. So once again, thank you for watching. I hope you had fun and I will see you all tomorrow. Goodbye.